help support the companies that support our community. Let's go outside, the snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand and watch a choir perform And all the Christmas songs that we love Yeah, all the Christmas songs that we love And in a while we're gonna go inside And drink our chocolate by the fire all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you Making plans for what we're gonna do I feel so blessed that I can be with you Cause God knows that I've been longing for ya I just wanna hold you close You know the stars are shining just for you Let's take a walk and we can follow the moonlight Till we reach a place we can stay Maybe kiss a bit and dream away And in a while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you Chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy Love and so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you Christmas memories I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep Yeah, I spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you are the good times with you baby this year is just gonna be you and me hang by the fire and chill isn't this how it's supposed to be making our christmas memories oh and i've been longing to hold you close forget about everyone else isn't this how it's supposed to be in our Christmas memories
sex So you should come back home to me And when we wake up in the morning I'm gonna play those carols that you love We'll be singing all the melodies Until the sun comes up These are the good times with you Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories Oh, and I've been longing to hold you close Forget about everyone else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories Once again, I use Dr. Walnut Oil to sand the piece, so I get a lot of questions about this stuff. I, I sand with it, I run through a couple of grits dry, and then I switch over to the walnut oil. And I just, it's a sanding lubricant, it captures all the dust, and it's putting the finish on at the same time. After I got all that done, went ahead and parted it off and glued it onto the top. So for the, uh, uh, pattern on it so a buddy of mine Michael Early uh, I'll have a link down below he's on Instagram and he does amazing work um, and he does a lot of basket illusion stuff so he sent me some pictures the other day of a Christmas ornament he did and he put a, a snowflake on it and I thought that was so cool and he, go, he goes you should do a video on it and I go all right I will so I just use the sangria it's um, um, it's just it's just a great natural color I don't don't have any the one he did had actually was what well, the whole thing was green and then he did a snowflake on it too but I don't have any green pins so maybe next time I will get that done well there it is so it is three and a half inches or three inches in diameter and five inches tall and I will drill a little hole in it and put a put a ribbon on it but a super fun project and something like this um, where it's a simple pattern like that super easy you might have noticed in the video too that when I was burning the vertical lines on it I don't know if you caught it but it was a little bit off so I have that platform that I use all the time and I just use it for burning those lines, but somehow it got off a little bit. I have this little disc on it that sets it right on the banjo, and somehow, I don't have any idea, but it got moved. So when you look at it, it's, it's kind of an illusion because it's actually going at a little bit of a curve because somehow it got moved up and it was, it was high. So when you set that up on the platform, if you're going to do basket illusion stuff, you set your burner on it in your little cradle like that, line it up just on dead center, and then it'll burn the line straight across. So what happened on that? It was a little bit high, so it was burning them at a little bit of an angle. So if you go back and watch that part of the video, yeah, it was. that's why, if, so if you did catch that, that's why it was off. All right. Uh, from last week, I wanted to clear up a couple of things because I did get some questions in the comment um, about Niles. Um, so we are going to continue to do videos every week. We're going to keep doing those. So that was something I maybe didn't explain that. Everything's going to stay the same there. What we did though was we started another YouTube channel for Niles Bottle Stoppers and I'm putting videos up over there too. And they are just uh, quick, uh, quick little um, kind of like how-to or tip videos. So Ruth gets a lot of questions off the website 
on you know specific things so I've been trying to put a video up over there once a week and it'll be how to install a, a stainless insert or um, you know just just different things or which mandrel works uh, which mandrel works best for what you need and the difference in, this, in between the different mandrels different stoppers things like that so if you do have any questions leave them below in the comments and I will put a video up on the, that YouTube channel over there and I will have a link to that channel down below in the description as well all right hope everybody has a good weekend um, oh one other thing before I go if you have done any uh, 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 of Ruth stuff if you've used her stoppers or openers or meat tenderizers chicken presses any of that please uh, send pictures to her her email is right there on the website she loves sharing them she has a whole section on the website for her gallery pictures she has hundreds of pictures over there if you're getting trying to get inspiration or just see some cool stuff there's some amazing work over there so head on over to there and check out the gallery page too all right, hope everybody has a great weekend and we'll see you next week.